Julian Rodriguez. He's here for the golden toilet. He is here to poop money figuratively and literally into the golden toilet. He probably would. All right, so we're back to dealer's life. We're just so happens to be week 44, day four. I'm recording at 444. There's four letters in life. I happen to be four years old as well. Everything revolves around the number four. Instead of the number 13 with that movie with Jim Carrey, today it's all about the number four, apparently. We have a legendary gold toilet, you know? Sometimes when you have so much money, you literally crap money. And where do you crap money? Well, you crap into a golden toilet. We also have a mythical item. A racing car produced in 1933, apparently it belonged to Elon Musk, I do believe it. And to be honest with you, we're getting to that point where we're almost done with the game essentially, because I have I think I've kind of like maxed everything out. There's a couple of things we can do here, like get up to Grandmaster. I guess we could do that, but at this point I feel like um, we've kind of reached that point where I think we kind of got everything covered, so we'll soon be wrapping this up, but I hope you guys have enjoyed it thus far. Okay, here we go, Mr. Muddybags. We have Roger Morona's cop. What is it this time? I assure you, I have no plans of selling that fake item. Luxury HD TV. Um, yes, I do have that. Well, let's see what we got here. Two greed, which means we probably won't get too much money out of it. But you know what? I paid 96000 for it, so how about you give me a nice old... I'll take... Uh, I'll sell it to you for one seventy-five. How about that? Selling an HD TV for $100,000. Can you imagine that? Is that such a possibility? Let's, all right, Will Smith, brainwash him. Okay, hold up. Don't run off yet, my boy. How about, how about 160,000? 124 is your last call. The estimated value is what you want to give me. I'm done flashing you, Will Smith. Put that away, Will Smith. Put it back in your pants. What do we got here? Epic good? Okay, it's not too bad. One greed? I guess we could probably do something about this. 180. 180 is what you're looking to give, no, see? That's the SMA Valley. 205 is what you want. <laughs> You're out of your mind. I'll give you 140, and I'm being very nice about this. There you go. Zero greed. We could probably get this off of you. Sure. How about... Eh, 55,000. How does that sound to you? I said 55,000. 69,000? Well, you know what I like, but no. 55,000. <sighs> okay, look, look. Look. 60, and it's, it's mine. I went up to 60, lady. Fine, just here. Take. I don't want to bring Will Smith out, but I will do it if you give me no choice. Counterfeits for you? Oh. If I don't want to ruin my reputation, huh? You know what? 480 is still pretty good. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'll do the right thing and sell off the bonfire that way. Next in line, by the way, you should probably get whatever money I'm about to give you to go get those teeth fixed. Because, you know, at least plug it up or something. I'll give you 25000 how dare you? I'm trying to help you out and you give me a last call that quickly. Epic, very good, 315, okay. Greed one. Well, what do you think you're doing, huh? You're giving me under the estimate already? What's your problem? Look, buddy. I'm thinking along the lines of 500,000 and it's yours. <laughs> who does, who does this guy think he is? Get the hell out of my store. Don't you ever come back. You're banned. You're banned forever. All right, let's see here. Greedy one. This over a hundred thousand HDTV. Let's go with um. I right, look. One seventy-five, and it's yours. Is that what I was offering last time? I think I was offering less for the other person. But we got it for one seventy-five. Good. All right. What about you? Okay. Big money. Greed zero. That's good. I'll accept it. What are you here for? You're here for the goal. Oh, I was hoping for something bigger, but sure. Alrighty. So, with the right person, we could almost get the double here. So 600 would be for the right person, close to 600 at the very least, but this is not the right person. So I'm thinking at least like 500 we'll start off with and see what they feel like. You're not moving from it, let's brainwash one more time. Let's try 480 this time. Nailed it, all right, so drop it by 20,000. We still got a really, really good profit out of that. Perfect. Let's get a value on you. And get the one up here. Yeah, I guess we'll do you as well. Sure. Okay. Um, shop for rent. Way too low. We're not going back there, boys. We're just moving up in the world. Come over here with that pimp cane with the snake wrapped around it. He's got a piercing as well. He's got the entire shebang. Epic good. I haven't really messed around with this, so yeah, I'm willing to get it off. For greed three, though, ooh, I'm not sure that's going to happen because this guy's going to probably want, like, you know, probably under the estimated value. Which we can't be doing that. I mean, I would... Just because you're a really greedy dude... 240. 
You see what I'm saying? Get out of here. It's not gonna happen with Greed 3. What do you got here? Rare terrible? That's actually really terrible. Don't, you know, I'm, I'm being courteous and accepting like 20,000 items. But under 5,000? Nah, man. Like, see, this is fine. We'll accept this. Plus, this guy's really angry, too. He's got that bandito mustache as well. You don't want to say no to this guy right here. What's his name? Hendrik Kravatz? Yeah, you don't want to say Kravitz? Apparently, you're related to Lenny Kravitz, too. Could be a better one, sure, for you, but not for me. I say 75. That's what I thought. Get out of here, bandito. Golden Knight. That's what you're here to offer to me. Greed, you got the right greed for this. Epic good. 46. Eh, sure, let's see. What do we got here? So I'm thinking maybe along the lines of a 25,000. 25,000. 25,000. That's what I thought. You gotta be stern. <laughs> what, what is this? Get this out of here. How dare you? Is that some sort of mall? It's a medieval mall. Epic good, 340. All right, the price is pretty good. You're a greedy man, so it's gonna be kind of a problem to get it off of you, unfortunately. Um, so I'm gonna say, like, um, it's gotta be close to the estimate when they're really that greedy. Hopefully 280. We should still be able to make a profit off of 280, though. Get out of here. Don't ever come back. Don't highball me that badly. Epic good, 520. Greed 2, yet again. How does 400,000 sound to you, my man? Not bad. Not bad at all. We got 120 under the estimate. Hopefully it's not fake or something like that. Guess we'll probably get right value on you. Get a right value on you. And we'll start working on... Oh, it's a fairly high... Oh, no, no, no. Let's, let's make sure that you're not fake before I go off and fix you. I want to be fixing something fake. I guess since you're already verified, get you back in two days. Sure. Julian Rodriguez. He's here for the golden toilet. He is here to poop money figuratively and literally into the golden toilet. He probably would. I'm surprised you're not even more greedy than that, but it kind of makes a little bit of sense here. So how about, I know we can't double it up. Double would be like around 400. I'm thinking along the lines of a good 320 for you. Okay, okay, I'm willing to bargain a bit more. Hold up, hold up, don't get yourself in a tizzy here. How about a good 280,000? Last call. Let's brainwash and go through this one more time. How about... 270,000. 270,000. Got it! Alright. Gotta be stern. Gotta use Will Smith properly. What you got here? Greed 2? Get this out of here. No, I wanna see it. Sunglasses at night. Get those out of here, okay? Don't you be wearing them at night, too. Um, this is what we just picked up recently. Haven't really gone through the entire steps to get it fixed up. I don't really care about doing that, so how about we just get it off of it right now? 108. Let's say 150, double what we paid, and it's yours. 150. There you go. Next. Oh, boys, okay. Please let this be about the car, okay? Richard Hale. Greed negative one. If this is about the car, big money time, boys. Ah! It wasn't the car. It was a decorated chopper. Okay, that's still good money, though. Um, Alright, so 960. Very, very good. Thinking double. Double would be... Almost two mil. We're not gonna get double off of his greed though. But close enough, maybe a nice 1.6 million. Should have probably went a little bit higher. I think we'd have got a bit more, but whatever. Got an extra million off of that alone, so I'm happy about it. Epic, very good. Greed is zero. That's a good greed number for that. So how about mm, 120,000 for your troubles? Nailed it. Next in line, what you got? Okay. Please be about the vehicle, Thomas Johnson. I don't know about your greed, it's the only problem. Boys, it is time. It is time. We'll start up a little bit high first, just to kind of test the waters. We have a couple of Will Smiths to go anyway. <gasps> oh, I thought we got it. I was like so excited. You didn't even give me a counter offer though. All right, let's brainwash one. Sorry, right, Will Smith, come on. I need you to get jiggy with it here and give you a hand. Um, he got really offended and wanted to leave immediately. So how about we drop it down to six million and seventy-five? My dude, how about you give me an offer? I'm doing six million just for you. What? What was it? Something I said? Come on. Made me use up all my Will Smiths. I'm still aiming for that, yeah, that's the one. Don't worry, White House, we're almost there. I just gotta, gotta sell off this vehicle. We're technically there. 
Alright, anything else that we can fix up? Yeah, it seems like a waste of time, really. Let's verify you, though. You've been verified and you're at 182? You've been verified? Yeah, let's go with this one. You're here for this, that's fine. I don't mind getting rid of that greedy one. Ah, uh, no, I don't like that price whatsoever, but I'm willing to get it off of my hands for maybe 60,000. That's your last call? I'm gonna use Will Smith on you. There's no point. Epic, very good, 64. The greed is the right number, too. The greed is the right number, so much that I'm thinking maybe 20... Oh, no, 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 don't do that. 28,000. 28,000. That's your last call at 32, half the price? That's fine. I was being a bit too stingy in that one, I will admit. Epic bad? Nah. Parrot Man, what you got here? Candlesticks, huh? Negative one greed. 81,000. 60. We could probably get this almost off of 100,000, if not 90. But 100 worked. That's good. What you got here, buddy? You got the Terminator figure, rare bad. Well, we could definitely fix this up. Greed 1, 58,000 is what you want. Uh, since we can fix it up and it's a bad, I'm thinking like 40,000. I'm thinking 40,000. Don't you dare deny me my price here. Chess legendary bad. 27,000 for a bad one, negative one greed. I think that works out pretty good for me. So I'm thinking uh, 15,000. That's your last call at 19. Sure, why not? I'm hoping you're here for the- Ah! You're here to give me a freaking axe? That's so low price. I was hoping you were coming here for the freaking vehicle. Well, I guess the alternative is selling it on auction, too. It is an alternative. But it's a gamble. It's a very, very big gamble. Is there something else we could sell on auction? Something fairly high-priced. 210. This guy's ready to go. No, I want to sell it myself because it's too much of a gamble. That's way too much money. Like, if we sell that off, we're technically at the White House already. So let's go with that one instead. All right. Anything else that we could um, fix or verify? I could fix you if I wanted to. No point in that because it's a counterfeit. 90,000 item. Hmm. I guess we'll verify you. And maybe fix Arnold. That's about it. Alright, pop it. We're in week 45. That vehicle right there, pick it up. Pick it up over your head like you're the Hulk. You're here to sell me a coin. You're here to sell me a coin that we don't know anything about. 38. Epic good. Get out of here. Somebody pick up the vehicle. You got a cannon. Rare good. Greed too high. Get out of here. I ain't dealing with that greed. LED TV. That's way less than the one that we got last time. Alright, money bags. You're here for the candlestick. Greed one, that is good. Maybe didn't fix that up. Um, 180 would be the double at this point. We're not gonna get double, but I'm thinking maybe along the lines of a 140? Maybe a little bit too high. But it worked! Alright boys, so we have an opportunity here again with Michael Da Vinci. You might have heard of him, he's apparently an artist. He's here for... the car. He's here for the car. He's negative one greed. Little bit of incompetence. He's a, he's fairly confident, I should say it too. He's a collector. Not sure about his impatient, but let's find out. What are you here to offer me? Oh, you want me to give you a price? Of course you would. Okay. So, uh, we have a couple of Will Smiths to burn. So let's start off high as usual at seven mil. Is what I'm starting off at. He's already in the ballpark, and he's not running away that quickly. So that's good. Let's um push it a bit more. <gasps> yes. Michael Da Vinci, you have put me very, very close to moving to the White House. We are almost there, boys. A couple of assails, we move up there. And unfortunately, I think that is what will probably wind up wrapping it up, but... Let's see, let's continue, guys. What is this? Nobody Sky poster? How about no game poster? <laughs> uh. Okay, so we have Brenda Hutton here with a big old briefcase with money. Greed 1, unfortunately. What item is this? This is gonna be for a book that we haven't really verified the value of, unfortunately. But we did pay 300000 estimated for 430 if that's correct. Let's see here. Alright, so you are offering over the estimate at the very least, so that's good. So 800000 is obviously out of the table. But what about a good old 600000 I think we could probably even push it at 7 with the right person. Even with her, it's kind of pushing at 560. I'll do it. I'll do it, just because we're very close to that White House. So we're up to 25 million now. We are ready to move off to the White House. We need to get a little bit more money before we continue. Apparently we have twins over here in line. But more importantly, this guy showed up. The special agent, which is completely new to me. 
We heard that you hired a brainwasher, a very unstable and dangerous person. Luckily, we came to know it before anyone got hurt or scammed. Well, you know what's gonna happen to you, my friend? You got it, just like this. We can resist to it only because we have really strong will and protective sunglasses that counter the brain washer effect. Ah, it didn't work. We're here to help. We will take in custody any brainwasher hired and clean the area. Will you? Of course we will. There's no need to thank us. No! No, he took Will Smith away! Tommy Lee! He took Will Smith away! How am I gonna brainwash these idiots into buying my stuff now? Alright boys, the time has finally come. 29 million in the bag. 25 million to move to the White House. And it's time to move over Trump. There's a new president in town. Rent and move. How many items do we have left? Two. And apparently one of them is being fixed, so we technically have one. And now we have no items for sale, but we have moved into the White House. We reached the peak of the game for the most part. So at this point, I'll leave it up to you guys. If you want to see a bit more, let me know. But I'm thinking we might be just about done here with this one. We have to at least open up once here to see how this goes. Look at the White House over here. Look at it. There's a big old chick in the center for some reason or another, but we're here at the White House. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. This is Dealer's Life. If you want to see some more, let me know, but I'm thinking this is a pretty good wrap-up point for us. We made it to the last store. I don't think there's anything else we really have to do unless, uh... Yeah, I guess we could waste some money to upgrade ourselves to Grandmaster. I'm not sure if anything happens there, but there you guys have it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. I will catch you next time.